Hi everybody. Um, I just wanted to send another video and we miss you guys. Um, and we can't wait till we get back um, to school and we can all be around our friends again. So I just wanted to read you a nice spring book with a spring activity maybe that you guys could do at home um, since we're all stuck in our houses. So I'm going to read you today The Very Hungry Caterpillar. Um, so let's get ready. In the light of the moon, a little egg lay on a leaf. One sunny Sunday morning, the warm same came up, and pop, out of the egg came a teeny and very hungry caterpillar. There he is. He started to look for some food. On Monday, he ate through one apple, but he was still hungry. On Tuesday, he ate through two pears, but he was still hungry. On Wednesday, he ate through three plums, but he was still hungry. On Thursday, he ate through four strawberries, but he was still hungry. On Friday, he ate through five oranges, but he was still hungry. On Saturday, he ate through one piece of chocolate cake, one ice cream cone, one pickle, one slice of Swiss cheese, one slice of salami, one lollipop, one piece of cherry pie, one sausage, one cupcake, and one slice of watermelon. It's a lot of food. That night, he had a stomach ache. The next day was Sunday again. The caterpillar ate through one nice green leaf, and after that, he felt much better. Now he wasn't hungry anymore, and he wasn't a little caterpillar anymore. He was a big, fat, caterpillar. He built a small house called a cocoon around himself. He stayed inside for more than two weeks. Then he nibbled a hole in the cocoon and pushed his way out. Really cool cocoon he made. Wonder what will happen. He was a beautiful butterfly. The end. So we read this book in our house with my kids, um, and then what we did is we took some things that we had around the house and we made some butterflies. So what we did is, this is Nolan's butterfly, so this is just a coffee filter. We colored it with markers, and then we took a spray bottle um, that I use every day for their hair, um, and sprayed the coffee filter, let it dry, and we happen to have pipe cleaners in the house, but some people may have clothes pins. Um, and you can clip it with a clothespin and all the colors seem to blend together and it makes a beautiful butterfly. This was mine. This was Molly's. Um, so this gave us something to do on a day um, since we are all stuck in the house. But we miss everyone. We can't wait to see everybody back at the Y. Um, and just everybody stay safe. See ya. Bye.